The holiday season is among us, and one local Winnipeg band is finally taking their album, released at the height of COVID in 2020, back to small communities as a way to give back to the small towns where they first got their start. It feels great to be able to take it to places outside of the urban centers and bring it out to folks who are living in rural situations. And as someone who grew up in, uh, in a small village, it means a lot to bring music into places that don't necessarily have access to that sort of thing on a regular basis. Danielle Pelican Hoffner is one third of the band Red Moon Road. He, along with other members Sheena Ratai and Daniel Jordan, are touring through rural Manitoba. Jordan says it's important for the band to always return to their roots. We always joke that the key to being big is go to small towns, but what we actually really mean is that we love being part of uh, communities. And so um, to take music back there, we have friends and uh, inspiration is, uh, is really meaningful to us. The show will be a little bit of a combination of traditional uh, holiday tunes and our original music that we released over the last couple years. The band has stops in Carmen, Manitou, St. Pierre Jolie, Porta de la Prairie, and Kenora. They say they're excited to be bringing audiences a trilingual show with classic carols sung in French, German, and English. Ratai says she hopes for connection, especially following the last few years of separation. I hope that when people leave the show, their takeaway is that they're just feeling uplifted and maybe a little more in the holiday spirit or just connected to one another, connected to themselves. That's always what I want. I want the music that we make to connect people to their own selves and to each other. There are incredible artists all over the rural landscape in Manitoba, the prairies and across Canada. So bringing music out to rural communities is just sort of bringing back to them what they may have given to the urban centre because a lot of people who are trying to make a career in the arts end up having to move to larger urban centres in order to facilitate their career. And so for me, uh, bringing music back to smaller villages is really just bringing back what, uh, what they gifted to the larger Canadian uh, artistic landscape. The tour starts December 7th. In Winnipeg, Joanne Roberts, City News.